Hello viewers, this is Eagles TV, you're welcome. We publish news on politics, celebrities, metro stories and news around the world. If this is your first time of watching, just subscribe to the red button below and tap to the bell beside it to keep you updated. We have a trending news for you today. The headline reads, Surprise! Buari APC dragged to election tribunal. Atiku shockingly not involved. These are indeed busy times for the election tribunal and latest case before it surprisingly does not involve the People's Democratic Party, PDP's presidential candidate Atiku Abubakar. But Hope Democratic Party, HDP, and the party has dragged President Mohamed Buhari, the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, and the All Progressives Congress, APC, before the Presidential Election Petition Tribunal, PEPT. Hatiku is currently in court fighting the result of the last presidential election which INEC declared Buhari as the winner with 15,191,847 of the total votes cast, while Atiku gained 11,262,978 votes, an astonishing victory margin of 3,928,000 869 votes. However, the list of disgruntled losers are evidently growing by the day. An Ambrose Ouru, presidential candidate of HDP, has challenged the legality of the presidential election earlier slated for February 16th, but later shifted to February 23, according to the news agency of Nigeria. The petitioner, who claimed to have been excluded from participating in February 23rd pool, averred that the election was invalid by reason of non-compliance with the provisions of the Electoral Act 2010, which stipulated the conditions under which an election could be lawfully postponed. Their major contention is that they were validly nominated for the 2019 general election, but were unlawfully excluded from the elections by INEC by delisting their names and party logo from the ballot papers. The petitioners maintained that they will, at the trial, lead evidence and rely on the law in support of their petition to establish that the shifting of the election from February 16th to 23rd was without the backing of law. Meanwhile, an expert motion filed by the petitioners seeking to serve the president with their petition and other processes will be heard at the Court of Appeal in Abuja on March 28th. The expert Motion filed by Yusuf Ibrahim is seeking an order of the court to serve President Buhari by pasting the petition at the Aso Villa Presidential Office, the National Secretariat of the APC and the Tribunal's Notice Board. The ex part motion followed an affidavit of non-service deposed to one by one Abubakar Mohammed chief bailiff of the court of appeal the bailiff claimed that security personnel at aso villa denied him access to enter and effect service on president buhari on the grounds that there was no directive from the president's office to that effect i know you would have a comment you can keep your comments so that we can brainstorm together god bless you for watching.